The country Liberals have held their annual conference in Darwin today and changed their rules for selecting election candidates. Anyone who has been a Country Liberals member for two years will be able to help pick the candidate for their electorate. The move could make it less likely the party will pick candidates who will embarrass or clash with its leader, Terry Mills. A year out from the Territory election, the Country Liberals president is demanding unity from a party which has spent a lot of energy ripping itself apart. Dave Tolner and all the MLAs and the party hierarchy are working very closely together and very constructively. Divisions over former Linkiari federal election candidate Leo Abbott's breach of a domestic violence order nearly undid the country Liberals' leader. A change to the party's candidate selection rules will make it difficult for those who want Leo Abbott to run again. The pre-selection panels will be broader in that members of the party who live in the electorate uh, who have been members for a qualified period of time and have lived in the electorate for a qualified period of time will be eligible to sit on pre-selection panels. Alison Anderson has said she may consider running for the country Liberals if the party selects her. But Labour is still accusing Terry Mills of backroom deals. Terry Mills needs to come clean, tell the truth to Territorians, what is his deal with Leo Abbott and what is his deal with Alison Anderson. I think Alison uh, would be welcome in the country Liberals. Terry Mills is acknowledging he has a lot of policy work to do before the election. It is not about us, it's not about the government, it's about Territorians and Territory families. They have certain expectations that it is our obligation to meet those expectations. Federal colleagues are warning the country Liberals, highlighting government failings won't be enough to get them elected. They would also have to present themselves as a credible and capable alternative. Jane Barton, ABC News.